This is music. This one is for Mark Morris. <laughs> A while ago, Mark Morris started a thread. The idea is basically to get to know his fellow VC members. I've seen Garage Geek's video. I've seen Morten Ostad's video. And I figured I'll make one too for the fun of it. He's got four questions for us. The first one is, do you have any other harpies than collecting vinyl? And if yes, which ones? And uh, yeah, I do. I collect CDs and I collect uh, cassettes too. I think that's part of the whole thing. To me, it's one big collection of physical music media. Uh, I don't know if this counts as a hobby, but I, I like just walking and uh, bicycling. So I like hiking. I like walking around town. I like just bicycling uh, different places. Uh, I'm also, uh, I don't know if that I count as a tea head, but I like trying different types of teas. Uh, loose leaf teas for the most part, but I like certain types of tea bag teas as well. I'm not too snobby with that. So, you know, like different types of green tea and black tea, post fermented teas, and uh, woolong teas and white teas and stuff like that. I enjoy that. I also brew my own kombucha, not because I want to be a hipster or anything, I just like it. So, there you go. Uh, I guess this counts as a hobby. I, I don't know. I know I don't look like it, but uh, I actually do weightlifting, not powerlifting, but uh, more like strength uh, training. And uh, I enjoy doing that. Uh, I've done that for a couple of years. I do it for health reasons mainly, not aesthetic reasons. So there we go. I haven't been able to work out for a while now, though, and that takes us to the next question. Uh, share some kind of fact uh, about yourself uh, with the rest of the vinyl community and here's a fact i have not been able to train because uh, not too long ago i had to undergo uh, emergency jaw surgery it's a minor procedure but still i got stitches all the way up here um, on the inside and i'm not allowed to exert myself too hard physically so no training so uh, there you go. Um, that's also why maybe I sound a little bit different because it has affected the way I speak uh, a bit temporarily, especially the uh, alveolar phonemes. What is that? That Those are the sounds we make when we've got the tip of the tongue somewhere near the alveolar ridge. That's the area just behind the, your front teeth, the upper front teeth. For some reason, that has affected those sounds. I don't know why. Uh, so there you go. That's a fact. Uh, yeah, another fact could be that I have actually published uh, several research papers uh, within the field of linguistics. That's part of my day job. Uh, very interesting, obviously, I think, uh, to work with that. And another fact, uh, I don't have a car because I don't want a car. Uh, I don't need a car. Um, I'm happy with my bicycle and my legs and public transportation. I used to have a car, but I found that it just made me lazy. Just took the car everywhere. So yeah, some facts. Uh, and then he also uh, wants us to show the first and last or and or last album we ever bought. The first album I ever bought, and a lot of people know this, is this one here, Iron Maiden, Somewhere in Time. It's not this copy, this is a reissue on vinyl. But I have bought this on cassette tape. That was the first music release I ever bought when I was a kid for my own allowance money. So there you go. I can't show you that tape because it's lost in time. I can show you the second one I ever bought because that is actually this copy of Iron Maiden Killers. The, the uh, case here is not the original one. I had to replace it because it was completely broken and busted. 
but it is the original tape and the original J card, and it barely plays, but it's cool to have it. Uh, the I'm one of the most recent uh, records I bought. I can show you that. It's not the last one, but it's one of them. This one here, the Peel Sessions by Carcass and Godflesh. So some uh, grindcore stuff, alternative noisy music. So there you go. Um, the most recent album I added to my uh, collection is not an album. It's an EP. It's Glory, Glory to the World by Love Bites. Uh, so there you go. Uh, he also, and this is going to be the fourth and last question, he wanted us to show his, our, not his, but our favorite movie. And uh, I can't show you my favorite movie because I do have multiple copies of it, different editions, but they're cocked in behind a bunch of cassette tapes. So I'm going to show you the soundtrack. And a lot of you already know this. Anyhow, The Empire Strikes Back, Star Wars, episode five but originally the second one and i have a japanese pressing too so there you go um i think most of this is stuff most people knew already but there you go that's my yeah i can also show you by the way this is a, a more recent addition to my collection except we've had it all along in the household just didn't know it so there you go anyways uh yeah Thanks for watching.